the Lamborghini Aventador is crowned as Lambo's most iconic model, and since its introduction in 2011, the family has grown considerably. After the base Aventador hit the road, it paved the way for models like the Aventador J, the LP750-4 Supervelos, the Dreamliner Edition, and was even used as the basis for cars like the Veneno and Centenario. By the time late 2016 came around, the car that was responsible for the aforementioned models, and replaced the Mercy Lago in the lineup, was due for an update that brought about a revamping of the car's aerodynamics and its chassis to go along with a mild update to power output as well. Now, in early September 2017, at least a month before the new 2018 Aventador S will be delivered to the first customers, Lambo has decided to present us with the Aventador S Roadster, the topless version of the new S that is destined to stand out next to its less frisky counterpart by means of unlimited headroom packed into a head-turning package. So that sounds good and all, but what does it really mean? Well, it means that the world's only super sports roadster with a mid-rear V12 is its own stand-alone model that's highly customizable with five different interior configurations, and an unlimited choice of exterior colors via the 80 Persona program. It takes four-wheel drive to an all-new level alongside things like the active suspension system, four-wheel steering system, and Lambo Classic LBS and LMS systems that were revised specifically for the Aventador S Roadster. So, even though the Aventador S Coupe is still fairly fresh in our minds, it's time to take a good look at its topless counterpart. And, you better hurry if you want to be informed, this baby makes its first official debut to the masses at none other than the 2017 Frankfurt Auto Show.